Hey, hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Double D's Quickie Reviews. You know what you should do right now, don't you? You should you should hit that, that like button right there. Go ahead. Give it a little tap. Give it a little love tap. Boop, boop. Yeah, yeah. Why not share this video with someone? Or maybe, yeah, maybe subscribe. Yes, might make it worth your while. Okay, I won't. I don't have anything. But, um, little announcement. Please stay tuned as soon as I get my garage clean for different types of content rather than just action figure opening. I'll also be doing videos on movies and rants on different things, but that's not important. Right now, today's quickie review is something that I bought a while ago. Misplaced it. And now here it is for your enjoyment. I give you Venom. Kick ass figure. Yes, it's not the I think it's the one from the movie. I'm, I have the movie on DVD. I just, well, Blu-ray, but I haven't watched it yet. I actually got that movie at the dollar store. But this one looks pretty cool. You got the classic tongue, alternate head, alternate hands, which are probably the ones I'm going to use. On display, on the side we have the symbiote. And then on the back, Focus. Focus. We might not be getting it. There we go. Failed reporter Eddie Brock is hijacked by an alien entity that takes liking to Earth and decides to protect it. Ah, as I said, I haven't seen a movie, so I don't know. But there we go. It's a cool looking figure from the box so far. Let's pop it open and take a look. I've already wasted enough of your time. Ooh. Yeah, we go. Trash can. Ooh. He looks beefy. The alternate head, more, I want to say cartoon accurate, if it would focus, I think that's good as we're going to get, but what you really need, man that's loud, that face we like it hmm where's that piece of cardboard there we go maybe that'll help it focus and there we go it is a beefy figure as I said weighs so good it's got some weird ass looking feet though it's more like a gorilla's feet. Maybe that's for a reason. I don't know. How's that looking on camera? There we go. And there he is. Got some weird little white lines. Good head. Beefy character. Thin legs. Has articulation in the wrist. The elbow. Is that a double elbow joint? Yes, it is. Double elbow joint. Upper bicep, shoulder, neck, head, uh, ab crunch. It's like a deep ab crunch. Upper thigh, double jointed knees, and ankle. All right, let's get back into this. Oops, jeez. We'll do the measurement real quick. He looks like a tall boy. Ooh, seven and a half inches. He's a big one. Look cool on the shelf though. Okay. Wanna take a look at this ab crunch? Ooh, look at that. 
the neck articulation could really use some work, you know, so he could swivel his head up and down, but... Yeah, yeah that neck articulation could use a lot of work. But he's got... Definitely has Spider-Man-like articulation. I haven't seen that on a figure this beefy before. The claws. Same thing on the back. The bo entire body seems to be textured somehow. Almost like he's oily. It's all oiled up for the gym. And that's really not much to say about him. Alright. Focused. Hope you're focused. There we go. Now the sculpting on the teeth is awesome. Could have used more fangs. The tongue is very well done. The painting is very crisp. Something you don't see all the time on Marvel Legends figures. I don't even know if this was a part of a wave or anything. Or a one-off. I just stumbled across it once. It's very well made. The why he has a belly button, I don't know. Anyways, and that is the Venom movie figure. It looks cool, and I like it. Not much more to say about it. it. doesn't really have that much paint apps. The lightning things, or whatever they're supposed to be, maybe veins, look very crisp. Very well painted. Other than that, I really have nothing to say about it. It's a nice looking figure. It's heavy. It's I'm pretty sure if this Venom took on Spider-Man, might be a different outcome. He looks more feral. More carnage if you will. And that's Venom, as I said. But just soak in all his goodness. Spin him around. Dude obviously does Pilates. If you don't understand that joke, uh, ask your parents. Delicious. And that's pretty much all there is. Thank you for watching. David's Quickie Review. You know what? Let's. No, it's not. Thank you for watching and uh, have a nice night. Please like, share, and subscribe as I said before. And have a nice night. Double D. Out. What it does, Venom talk like Gollum? Hmm. Coincidence? Maybe. But have you seen them both in the same room at once? I haven't. Bloop.